Hello and welcome to the Manifesting You YouTube channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. This is going to be a uh, heart love oracle reading for the twin flame female feminine energy for the month of May 2016. So this is focusing on the female twin um, in the twin flame soul uh, union and what are the messages or what is going to help her heal herself and vibrate to her highest frequency to help aid the partnership, aid the coming together of the union or whatever the divine will is in the union. So um, this is the, a singular oracle message or tarot reading for the feminine twin. And also check out, I have a male twin for the month of May and also the general twin flame relationship reading for the month of May. So I've shuffled seven times, asked for guidance. Let's get started. Okay, female twins, um, God in the universe lets us know we have two, the sacral chakra. Okay, so the orange in this card is symbolizing warmth, caring, creativity, curiosity, pleasure, perseverance, self-esteem, personal power, and also deception. Um, set that down there. The key words for the sacral chakra is I want. Uh, the element is water and it represents the ovaries or the feminine, um, you know, reproductive system. And the sacral chakra is the second chakra. It's right two fingers below your navel. It relates to your emotions, your desires, your creativity, and your sexuality. Um, to encourage or bring light to this chakra, you can always visualize orange sparkling light, glowing ball of light uh, in that area. You can see it sparkling and just a, in a bright orange light. It's really gonna energize and cleanse and clear that area. Feel joy as that light kind of glows in that area as it grows larger. And by energizing the sacral chakra, you attract creativity, joy, passion, and love into your life. Okay, so <laughs> um, it's just so funny how the universe does not make mistakes because the last crystal reading for the month of for the month of April for the feminine energy was joy. And I feel like this is still the issue for the feminine. Because the orange also, it has to do with self-esteem. I, I really feel strongly self-esteem and personal power um, and finding those things that make the feminine twin joyful. Joy is huge, ladies, it's huge. I just notice that when I'm in my joy, when I literally, I think as women just in general too, we're so used to catering for other people and finding our happiness in other people. It's like we don't even realize it. It's like it's a subconscious thing. And those moments that I have literally just had joy in myself, like I don't need any, anything else, any other source, because I'm just joyful in me. I'm joyful in my being. I'm joyful in my creativity. I'm joyful in my own power, in my own creative power. When I feel that, people are drawn to that magnetically. And I think especially the opposite sex. I, I know it seems counterintuitive because our, you know, the world or whatever, it wants to tell us that, if we serve our man and if we just totally like cater to him, and I'm not saying it's not good to serve. I'm just saying when it's, it's out of balance, when we haven't done enough of our own personal work, we can't really give out of that place of abundance. And so I think that our twin flame is going to be most drawn to us when we are radiating that sense of joy and that sense of personal power and confidence. So obviously for the month of May, the twin flame feminine, this is still a key issue, self-esteem. And, uh, you know, and it kind of relates to uh, what we read in the general reading about that changing your thoughts and your beliefs, it takes time. It's a process. 
And I know that it's like we kind of all want a quick fix. I mean, it's just, I think it's human nature. But this, this process of finding your joy and your inner satisfaction and your own sense of self and personal power, you know, that's a journey. It can take, you know, there, there's not like a set time limit, okay? So um, using this color, and you know what's funny is I have actually really been drawn to orange lately. <laughs> I wore orange lipstick the other day. I've been eating a lot of oranges, <laughs> so I just find that interesting. And normally orange is not my favorite color. Uh, but there is a very, there's a vibrancy, there's a power, there's an optimism. And I, whenever I'm feeling like low in self-esteem or self-confidence, I gravitate towards orange. So for the month of May, this looks like for the feminine energy, this orange, you know, pleasure, optimism, creativity is, is where the twin flame feminine needs to nurture to grow. And in that it is going to help her union help her twin flame or his, whatever energy this is, you know, fitting for you. Um, that is what's going to help manifest our highest and best selves. So thank you so much for watching. If this video has encouraged you or inspired you, I would so appreciate if you would like and subscribe to this channel that is going to assure you to get the monthly readings and any tips and tools that come out to help you manifest and be your highest and best self. And don't forget to check out the masculine reading for the month of May and the general twin flame reading as well. And also your Zodiac sign readings. So thank you so much again for watching. Have a beautiful rest of your day.